All right, and we're back on the weekender with one of Dallas's hottest new bands, and that's Silver Gun. And right here, I got the guys right with me to find out exclusively what's made them so hot in the past year. You guys haven't even been around a year, and, and we keep hearing about you guys. How did this happen? We've all worked together before in some different projects, and uh, we all just knew each other from uh, from different music uh, scenes around Dallas and that, and we just we always knew we wanted to work together. Yeah. Well, and the Dallas music scene is an interesting music scene that's always changing. So how do you rise above and stand out? I think you have to have, I think it's the music. I think, you know, you can try all the, uh, all the, uh, the types of uh, social media and marketing, but you really have to have the music to back it up. That's really what it comes down to. Yeah, now this is an interesting sound. You guys don't sound like a lot of the bands that I've heard in Dallas. So what, what are the influences that we're hearing here? Shannon? <laughs> Man, everything from 80s hair metal to 70s classic rock. I mean, just straightforward rock. You know, if it's got a groove, it's got a great melody and a really good hook, I mean, you know, add some crunchy killer guitar to it and, you know, got a recipe for rock and roll, dude. Yeah, well, there is a time when the 80s hair metal wasn't, uh, people weren't admitting to as much, but now I feel like it's kind of come back around. Do you feel that way? Oh, dude, there's 80s hair metal never died, dude. They just, it was, it was a closet addiction nobody wanted to <laughs> fess up to. I guarantee everybody had their Motley Crue CDs still in their car, <laughs> you know, right next to Nirvana. They just didn't want to tell anybody about it. All right, so who are your, some of your favorite 80s heavy metal bands? Uh, Sebastian Bach is the greatest heavy metal singer ever, mm -hmm. and Ryan James Dio, of course. But um, uh, Skid Row and Motley Crue are my favorite bands. Um, as far as singers go, I mean, Man, Freddie Mercury is the greatest. I love Elvis. I love George Michael. I mean, all those guys are great. Great singers, Neil. great entertainers. Yeah. Now, one thing that's getting a lot of attention for you guys is the video. And, uh, and you know, it's kind of what people want to see in a rock and roll video. We've got, you know, loud guitars, got girls, you know, this is, this is, but this is kind of the lifestyle, isn't it? All your favorite stuff. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's what makes music fun, man. I mean, it's an escape for most people, you know. Um, you talk about 80s hair metal and 70s classic rock and all this stuff, I mean, and I'm not bagging on the 90s or anything like that, but, you know, things got a little serious for a while. I mean, it's cool to have like these serious topics, but that's just not us. I mean, it's about having fun and, you know, girls and partying and rock and roll. It's know? all about the party. Yeah. Well, you write about what you know, right? Yeah. Well, and that's, that's what makes it real, and that's what makes people relate to it. Yeah. And, uh, and I think that's a whole lot of fun, and so yeah. thank you guys for bringing that out in you. Now, where can people hear a little bit of your music? Uh, the fastest way to check out something we've done with Reverb Nation. And uh, we've got some music posted there. And uh, it's uh, not only a great place to post some music, but it is pretty cool to find some new bands that you wouldn't find anywhere else. You know, and it's, it's a great tool for bands to uh, promote their music. And uh, I, I found a lot of cool stuff on there too that I, I wouldn't have seen someplace else. So Definitely. That, that's, that's really cool. And yeah. they make it easy for you to do stuff. Um, yeah. It's a great platform for yeah. you know, independent artists you know, to get your stuff out there. Now I understand the live show is what you want to see though. So when can we see you guys live again? We're working on a few dates right now. Right now, we're mostly concentrating on the studio. Um, going back to studio uh, August 5th, 6th, and going to start working on another tune we're doing for uh, perhaps another feature film. And it's all just a bunch of songs we're recording that we're going to eventually make into a full length CD. Great. And the cool. website is Silver Gun Rocks? Yeah. I come? Yep. Great. Well, we're so happy to have you guys right here on the Weekender with us. We're going to keep a an eye on what you guys are doing, and congratulations on all the success so far. Thank so you. we'll be back with more of the weekend or next. Check out more of Silver Gun on silvergunrocks.com.